Well, in this week's video, we're looking at Yammer. Well, what is it? Well, Yammer is Microsoft's social media platform. So sometimes you want to communicate with colleagues in a, in a less formal way. And, and this allows you to have uh, share information, have conversations, uh, update colleagues in a social media format. So let's have a look at it. So at the top left here, we can move between home which allows you to create groups and discover groups that have been set up within your organization. So a group could consist of uh, employees in the same team. Messages allow you to send messages to the whole of the organization and the bell shows any notifications um, as to uh, make you aware of any communication that you've been included in. So we go back to home. It's very easy to make a post. If we click on the box, we can add an animated GIF. We can select a file on SharePoint. We can select a file that we've already uploaded to Yammer, or we can upload a file. We can type in some text. and we can add a link and it'll it'll give you a, a quick preview of the link and you can choose to remove that or not and then you can choose who you want to notify and you can search for colleagues within your organization or you can just so we can add people or you could just select the whole organization or you could add a group so if you created a group you could put them in there or you could put all company and hit post and as with most social medias when you do that it gives you the information you provided and it previews in this case it was a YouTube video you have the ability to share that further you can edit that and people can like it people can also reply to it so it's it's a great way for sharing information and resources um, encouraging some staff debate in a, a, maybe a less formal way and, and outside of email I think we probably all agree we get far too many emails so you can create new messages just by clicking create message you can click all to, to see who's posted an all company message you can also create a poll a very simple poll to get some maybe some some peer feedback from colleagues on a particular thing and you can praise so you can share something and and c congratulate someone on what they've done if you want to create a group so you can bring together your your colleagues you can click create group you can choose whether that be an internal group just inside your organization or an external group so you put in the group name you can add their group names by email and you can choose whether anyone in this network can view the conversations or whether it's only for members so it could be a great way to welcome new colleagues so you could do a new starter Yammer group and then invite new colleagues to be part of that and you could then share resources and have conversations there it's also a great way to share teaching and learning resources and, and to share good practice. So if colleagues have been doing some interesting stuff with their students, as far as teaching and learning goes, you could then share those resources and have those conversations. So there you have it, a quick look at Yammer, a great way to share information in a less formal environment with colleagues and peers. I hope you found the video useful. If you did, please remember to share and subscribe to the channel and tick the bell to make sure you get the notifications and when we upload fresh videos. Thanks for watching, join me again soon for more EdTech videos.